Welcome back YouTube. I um, changed that shim plate out, the shim plate drop for the Stoger M3000, and it worked. Now my line of sight is perfect. I just want to show you the shim plates here. This is the original one that was in the gun installed, and that is a 60R, right 60. I went down to the 50. As you know, in my last video, I showed you the differences. 65 left, or but you turn them over, it's left and right. So one side's right, one side's left, depending on what you are. The 65 is as high as they give you. 55 is the next size I would have went to if the 50 didn't work. You don't have a lot of information on it in the manual. That's all they show you is that right there. And they tell you what it is right there. That is a shim plate drop. So what it was was my line of sight was too high when I put my eye up to it. So now because I've done that, I don't have to adjust my eye anymore. It lines up perfect. And if you watch my other video, the first one was Stogram 3000 loose buttstock. I uh, showed you how to fix that. And then the second video, which I forgot to name, that's where I showed you a lot more about the shims and how to put those in there to adjust your cant up or down. All right. Hey, it works real good. Have a good one.